Nice to meet you, Hi, nice to Mr. Meet you. Mr. Dunk, Mr. Mr. Jump, Mr. Jump, <laughs> Dunk, Mr. Jump. Um, can you can you introduce yourself? What you're doing in your yeah, life? Yeah, of course. Um, I'm Marco, aka Mr. Jump, and a professional dunker from Italy. And uh, I perform in my country, in Italy, and also in Europe. Uh, last year, in October, I was in China, so I hope one day uh, I can perform in all around the world. So that's my dream. Yeah. And there are uh, different diff different places you have been to. Uh, also in Italy, can you tell us like five or six places you have been dunking to? In, in Italy? Yeah, also uh, in Italy. I was in Florence, Sardinia, uh, Rome, Milan of course, it's my city, uh, Trieste, all, all around Italy, from and, north to south. And even China? Yes, in China. Uh, it was last year because um, I won the in, in the finals in, in, in Italy and there was the... Um, because there was the national Italian uh, tournament. Um, so I went in China with the national Italian team uh, at in China, in Guangzhou for the um, FIBA uh, 3x3. Mm -hmm. um, and I was there for the dunk contest. I, um, I, got the, I did the quali qualifications and um, the day after I arrived third. So I, I took the bronze medal. Nice. So yes, yes, it was a great experience there. And and first we talked about um, it, it's it's your job to dunk. Yes. And funny wise, I ask you, is your mother proud? <laughs> yes. Uh, at the beginning, she was like, "Oh, what are you doing? This is not a sport. Uh, you 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 work. You was good in basketball. So why you change your way?" But now she say, "Oh wow, you arrived here. You you start from from a basketball court near your near our house, but now you are uh, going uh, and traveling uh, all around the Italy and Europe. Uh, and uh, she's worried because uh, you know the mom say, "Oh, you you go far from every time you travel alone." But she's very happy and proud of me of what I'm doing. So, and when you will earn more money, will what will you buy your mother? Uh, sometimes I try to to bring something from the uh, uh, yeah. different places where I go, so I try to. Uh, but will you buy her a, a car or a house when you earn a lot? Oh no, <laughs> no, not so much, but a little gift. Or... Okay, but but in future maybe. In future, yeah, I hope to to live with it and uh, and buy, of course, my house, my cars. Everything nice. I need, so that's the target. And uh, with the crossover nation, you are now here. And Marcus asked you last year to come. Uh, are you happy to be here? Yeah, of course. I'm really glad to be here. Um, you know, when when there are kids, uh, I'm always uh, happy because they are so excited to to see something different, to see a dunk show. And uh, this is the reason why I try to to bring them in the show and try to maybe jump over them. Ah, yeah. So I think uh, they will like it. I hope so. So, w which uh, dunks will you show us today? Uh, I will show um, all my stuff. I, th I think I will try to to show you um, my repert uh, my repertoire. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Um, of course, I will do my wheel miss between the legs, three six between the legs, jump over guys. Um, throwing the ball behind the back and doing win me behind the back uh, 360s something like that double pump nice double pump pump yeah, back to the basket pump. yeah <laughs> nice and uh, what what are your favorite dunkers in the NBA dunkers uh, Zach Lavine of course yeah uh, I think he's the best dunker in the world and he's not a pro dunker but he could be <laughs> the best one so. He's crazy. He's crazy athleticism. Uh, and and the, the guy who made uh, with the Superman shirt. Oh, uh, Dwight Howard. Yeah, you like him? Yes, yes. Um, it was uh, in 2008 because I'm fan. You know, I know every yeah. dunk contest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He won it. It was 2008. Eight and nine. Yeah. Already so long ago. I didn't know. <laughs> <laughs> yes, but I really like it. But you know, he's about two meters and twelve, so it's so much Easy. easier for him. Yeah. But. Uh, for his body and his weight, he he can do crazy, crazy stuff. So it's and great, great. And how tall are you? Uh, I'm six three. That it's uh, one meter and nineteen. 
But it's not that big. I mean, um, no, I know you I, have to be. You have to really jump high to get it. Yeah, yeah, I know. I'm not so big. Also in basketball, maybe I could be a playmaker in NBA. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but uh, yes, uh, I think uh, it's a great hate for uh, for dunking. Not so much, but perfect hate. And what what is your what was your favorite moment as a dunker since now? Uh, I think uh, last year in China because uh, it was the first time I was so far from my house and I was uh, in, in another continent. Uh, a lot of people, you know, China. I was in a city with uh, two thousand uh, two millions of people. Yes, and the location was cool, really cool, uh, and the atmosphere was amazing. So, and I saw on Instagram also. You meet uh, NBA players. Yes, sometimes uh, I met uh, stars like Kevin Durant. I met him when I was in Milan to my basketball court. I was there for uh, for training, and uh, I was going at home. And some guys said to me, "Oh, stay here because there is a surprise." So I stayed there, and um, when it comes to the court, I say, "Wow, there's Kevin Durant." And his bodyguard says to me, oh, come here and play one-on-one with Kevin. I say, oh, I'm just a dunker, so I want to dunk with him. Yeah. And he started dunking, he missed, and uh, I, I made his dunks. So <laughs> it was a really funny moment. And, But yes, it was yes. just seconds, you didn't talk about anything uh, just, with him. Yes, two minutes, he says, oh, he says to me, throw, throw the ball, uh, shooting, shooting. And I say, no, no, dunking. Go first, no, go first, you. <laughs> nice. It's crazy, yeah. And in the future, um, uh, where you want to be with, with, with dunking? I mean, uh, do you want to build your own squad? You want to, what, the marketing wise, what will be the next step? Okay, for the moment, um, I like to, um, to working alone because I, um, I stayed in, the two, in two teams in Italy and have um, problems, but it's okay. I miss that uh, I, I travel uh, with the, the guys, it was my friends, but now it's different. And now I, I'm a professional dunker, so that's great. In the future, maybe I hope to, um, to find other guys, to maybe create another team. And uh, of course, my, my biggest dream is to create a school of dunks. Yeah. Uh, so of course, in Milan, uh, in Italy, I hope to be enough famous for create um, and becoming um, a symbol of dunks in Italy. That's, uh, that's my target. Just a, a legend, maybe <laughs> one day. <laughs> yeah, hopefully, if you have if that's, you have the big dream for it, it you can go it. But it's hard work. Yeah, you know, yeah, it's yeah. hard work. Yeah, I know. And if I I think if you put a lot of work into it, uh, it would work. You can also spin the ball. Yeah, yeah, I mean, of course, like, yes. I, I learned it from my uh, freestyle friends, so I can some stuff like that. This is the trick uh, called around the world. Yeah, can you give it to me, like when yeah, you spin of course. it, like it's, maybe I'm it's easier? Like... Yes. Alone? Nice. Can you try alone? Can you nice. try alone? I, don't know. <laughs> I always try it, but I like, never do it. It's really hard. But maybe I can give it to you. No, I can't. Like yeah, here, yeah, we can try. Back, but... And, 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 and there is also a uh, cruise in Italy who does uh, freestyle stuff yes, like in, the globe trotters and yeah, stuff. Yeah, yeah, something like that. Yes, when I was uh, in my first team, there was uh, three freestylers and was with, so good with the ball, doing some stuff like that, spin, uh, ball handling. Uh, so th I think that's a good part of shows. And you also go and, and you were on the streets, um, kind of with the shows and taking money from the streets or also at competitions? Uh, no, I tried one time but not so good. So I think it's more professional to be called from events like this camp or uh, yeah. dunk contest or something like that. So in your school of basketball, of dunking, you will teach kids and uh, young athletes how to dunk the best way? Yes, yes, of course. I think um, the most important thing uh, it's to begin from the low rim because uh, when I start I try to I try to dunk uh, in low rim for a uh, lower technique you know for the wheel miss behind mm -hmm. the back because um, if you're not gift if you are not a talent it's hard to start from the regular rim because you have to jump height yeah. and it's hard to to close some stuff so first of all yes uh, we will see today to the, the at dunk contest of kids. Uh, okay, we'll, we'll I will try to maybe to learn something. Can we can we stand up? Does it work with the camera to yeah, see course. what's the difference between our size? 
It's like I could dunk as well because I'm not that small, <laughs> but he's a dunker, you see. And our legs, you see, I got pretty much bigger legs than him, you see. But he can <laughs> dunk. He's, he's I don't cuff, know what's yeah. it. I have a, lo a lot of. And if we could get like when we when we smash our hands together in the air, like but jumping, then I can see how, how far you can jump up. Maybe also with that. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Close. You get it? Okay. Let's do it. <laughs> no, just oh, get, just get, get your highest jump. <laughs> oh, oh he stopped me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, just check this guy out. He's gonna be on Instagram or on Facebook. Follow me, please. Marco, you, Mr. Jump. Marco, under, under slash Mr. Jump on Instagram. And the same on Facebook. Try to um, be cool. Yeah. And don't do alcohol and drugs and stuff like that. Just be an athlete and keep on following your dreams. Okay, thank you guys, see you. Thank you, man. <laughs> no problem. <laughs>